Michelin, full name, from Cagney General Night Atlasments Michelin SCA, is a French multinational tire manufacturing company based in clermont ferrand in the Auvergne rhone alps region of France. It is the largest tire manufacturer in the world before Bridgestone and larger than both Goodyear and Continental. In addition to the Michelin brand, it also owns the Cleaver Tire Company, Mineral Goodrich Tire Company, Fascar, located on Canso Brands. Michelin is also notable for its red and green travel guides, its roadmaps, the Michelin stars at the Red Guide Awards for restaurants for their cooking, and for its company mascot Vendum, colloquially known as the Michelin Man. Michelin's numerous inventions include the removable tire, the Nurail, a tire, for rubber tired metros, and the radial tire. Michelin manufactures tires for space shuttles, aircraft, automobiles, heavy equipment, motorcycles, and bicycles. In 2012, the group produced 166 million tires at 69 facilities located in 18 countries. In 1889, two brothers, Edward Michelin and Andre Michelin, ran a rubber factory in clermont ferrand France. One day, a cyclist whose pneumatic tire needed repair turned up at the factory. The tire was glued to the rim, and it took over three hours to remove and repair the tire, which then needed to be left overnight to dry. The next day, Edward Michelin took the repaired bicycle into the factory yard to test. After only a few hundred meters, the tire failed. Despite the setback, Edward was enthusiastic about the pneumatic tire, and he and his brother worked on creating their own version, one that did not need to be glued to the rim. Michelin was incorporated on 28 May 1889. In 1891 Michelin took out its first patent for a removable pneumatic tire, which was used by Charles Perrin to win the world's first long-distance cycle race, the 1891 Paris to Brest to Paris. In the 1920s and 1930s, Michelin operated large rubber plantations in Vietnam. Conditions at these plantations led to the famous lever movement Fu Rindu. In 1934, Michelin introduced a tire which, if punctured, would run on a special foam lining, a design now known as a run-flat tire, self-supporting type. Michelin developed and patented a key innovation in tire history, the 1946 radial tire, and successfully exploited this technological innovation to become one of the world's leading tire manufacturers. The radial was initially marketed as the X tire. It was developed with a front-wheel drive Citroen traction and and Citroen 2CV in mind. Michelin had bought the then bankrupt Citroen in the 1930s. Because of its superiority in handling and fuel economy, use of this tire quickly spread throughout Europe and Asia. In the U.S., the outdated bias play tire persisted with market share of 87% in 1967. In 1966, Michelin partnered with Sears to produce radial tires under the Allstate brand and was selling 1 million units annually by 1970. In 1968, Michelin opened its first North American sales office and was able to grow that market for its products rapidly. By 1989, the company had 10% market share for OEM tires purchased by American automobile makers. Also in 1968, Consumer Reports, an influential American magazine, acknowledged the superiority of the radial construction, setting off a rapid decline in Michelin's competitor technology. In the U.S., the radial tire now has a market share of 100%. In addition to the private label and replacement tire market, Michelin scored an early OEM tire win in North America when it received the contract for the 1970 Continental Mark III, the first American car with radial tires fitted as standard. In 1989, Michelin acquired the recently merged tire and rubber manufacturing divisions of the American firm's DF. Goodrich Company, founded in 1870, and Unaroyal, Incorporated, founded in 1892 as the United States Rubber Company, from Clayton, Duvalier and Rice. Unaroyal Australia had already been bought by Bridgestone in 1980. This purchase included the Norwood, North Carolina manufacturing plant which supplied tires to the U.S. Space Shuttle Program. In December 2018, Michelin acquired Canso, a manufacturer of off-the-road tires, tracks, and accessories for power sports, agriculture, material handling, and construction markets. Michelin also controls 90% of Flora's tire in Hungary, as well as Cormoran, a Polish brand.
As of 1 September 2008, Michelin is again the world's largest tire manufacturer after spending two years as number two behind Bridgestone. Michelin produces tires in France, Serbia, Poland, Spain, Germany, the U.S., the U.K., Canada, Brazil, Thailand, Japan, India, Italy and several other countries. On 15 January 2010, Michelin announced the closing of its soda, Japan plant, which employs 380 workers and makes the Michelin excise tire. Production of the excise will be moved to Europe, North America and elsewhere in Asia. In 2019, Michelin announced that plants in Germany and France are to be closed soon. Michelin participated in MotoGP from 1972 to 2008. They introduced radial construction to MotoGP in 1984 and multi-compound tires in 1994. They achieved 360 victories in 36 years and from 1993 to 2006, the World Championship had gone to a writer on Michelin's. In 2007, Casey Stoner on Bridgestone Tires won the World Championship in dominating fashion and Valentino Rossi and other top writers complained that Michelin's were inferior. Rossi wanted Bridgestone's for the 2008 season, but Bridgestone was reluctant to provide them. Dorna threatened to impose a control tire on the series, after which Bridgestone relented it. In 2008, Michelin committed errors of judgment in allocating adequate tires for some of the race weekends. Tommy Pedroza's team switched to Bridgestone in the midst of the season, a highly unusual move that caused friction between Honda Racing Corporation and their sponsor XOYTF. Other writers also expressed concern that it seemed that Michelin might not have any factory writers for the 2009 season, leading to rumors that Michelin would withdraw from the series altogether. Dorn on the FIM announced that a control tire would be imposed on MotoGP for the 2009 season and Michelin did not enter a bid, effectively ending its participation in the series at the end of 2008. Michelin returned to MotoGP in 2016 as official tire supplier after Bridgestone's withdrawal from the series at the end of 2015. Michelin first competed in the 1977 Formula One season when Renault started development of their turbo, charged F1 car. Michelin introduced radial tire technology to Formula One and won the Formula One Drivers' Championship with Gravelman and McLaren before withdrawing at the end of 1984. The company returned to Formula One in 2001, supplying the Williams, Jaguar, Venetton, renamed Renault in 2002, crossed and minority teams. Toyota joined F1 in 2002 with Michelin Tires and McLaren also signed up with the company. Michelin Tires were initially uncompetitive but by the 2005 season were totally dominant. This was partly because the new regulations stated that tires must last the whole race distance and qualifying and partly because only one top team, Ferrari, was running Bridgestones and so had to do much of the development work. Michelin, in contrast, had much more testing and race data provided by the larger number of teams running their tires. Following the debacle of the 2005 United States Grand Prix where, because of safety concerns, Michelin would not allow the teams it supplied to race, Michelin share price fell by 2.5%, though it recovered later the same day. On 28 June, Michelin announced that it would offer compensation to all race fans who had bought tickets for the Grand Prix. The company committed to refunding the price of all tickets for the race. Additionally, it announced that it would provide 20,000 complimentary tickets for the 2006 race to spectators who had attended the 2005 event. Michelin has had a difficult relationship with a sports governing body, the FIA, since around 2003 and this escalated to apparent disdain between the two parties during the 2005 season. The most high-profile disagreement was at the United States Grand Prix and the acrimony afterwards. Michelin criticized the FIA's intention to move to a single source, that is, one brand, tire from 2008 and threatened to withdraw from the sport. In a public rebuke FIA President Max Mosley wrote, there are simple arguments for a single tire, and if Michelin boss Edward Michelin is not aware of this, he shows an almost comical lack of knowledge of modern Formula One. 
Another low note contention has been the reintroduction of tire changes during pit stops from 2006. Mitchell criticized the move claiming this even illustrates F1's problems of incoherent decision making and lack of transparency. In December 2005, and as a result of a difficult relationship with a sports governing body, Michelin announced that it would not extend its involvement in Formula One beyond the 2006 season. Bridgestone was then the sole supplier of tires to Formula One until the end of the 2010 season, with Pirelli providing tires for 2011. The last race, won on Michelin tires, in Formula One was the 2006 Japanese Grand Prix, Fernando Alonso benefiting after the Ferrari engine of Michael Schumacher failed during the race. This gave Michelin a second consecutive, constructors championship win with a 2005 and 2006 after Bridgestone's seven-year winning streak and brought to a total of four of the number of titles for Michelin since this championship's inception that in the 1958 Formula One season, Michelin's other titles were in the 1979 and 1984 seasons. Michelin is involved in endurance races such as the 24 Hours of Le Mans and the American Le Mans series. Involvement in Le Mans began with supplying tires for the winner of the inaugural 1923-24 hours of Le Mans as well as nine others of the 33 in France. In 2009 Michelin supplied tires for 41 of the 55 cars entered in Le Mans. In 2016 they provide the Audi, Porsche and Toyota LMP1 teams as well as the AF course, the MW, Corvette, Ford Ganassi, Porsche and Rizzi teams in GTE Pro slash GTE LM. Beginning in 2019, Michelin will replace Continental as the official tire of the WeatherTech Sports Car Championship. Along with supplying tires for INSA's top three series, the partnership includes naming rights for the Sports Car Challenge Series and the North American Endurance Cup. Michelin has also supplied tires in the European Le Mans Series. They have been the exclusive supplier of the LMP3 class since 2015. In the World Rally Championship, Michelin has been supplier of the Audi, Citroën, Ford, Lancia, Mitsubishi, Puget, Toyota and Volkswagen factory teams. Michelin Group brand the F. Goodrich represented the brand in 2006 and 2007. The company was absent from 2008 to 2010 when Pirelli was signed as the official supplier, after which they returned to the series as official supplier from 2011 to 2020 until Pirelli won the tender to once again become official supplier from 2021 onwards. Recent developments are Tax System Twill X1 Agri Vaz Technology Michelin employs specific tread construction that uses spiral wrapped nylon strips. The strips are applied in tread area above steel belts in order to oppose centripetal force in order to avoid tire distortion at high speeds. Evergrip technology. This is a patented safety technology that allows combining tread growth design. This way, it does not just wear down, but evolves due to high traction tread compound that makes drive safer on snowy and wet roads. Zero pressure technology means reinforced sidewall that is designed to continue supporting the vehicle's weight even when air pressure is lost. The technology allows to continue driving at speeds between 50 and 55 miles per hour for some time. Active wheel from Michelin includes in wheel electric motors and a motor suspension to free up space in the front or rear of the vehicle. This model also eliminates the need for other notorious space hogs like transmissions and exhaust systems. The wheels already have a vehicle ready to receive them, the Ulias will from Opel and are also expected to come standard on the Venturi Volage sometime in 2012. The project was interrupted in 2014. Tire retail in Europe with Euromaster and in the US with its wholly owned subsidiary TCI Tire Centers. Michelin has long published two guidebook series, the Red Guides to Hotels and Restaurants and the Green Guides for Tourism. It now publishes several additional guides, as well as digital map and guide products. The city maps, in both the red and the green guides, are of high quality and are linked to the smaller scale road maps. Michelin publishes a variety of road maps, mostly of France but also of other European countries, countries in Africa, Thailand and the United States. 
They have recently embarked an e-commerce selling Michelin maps and guides directly to the public through, for example, their UK website. The Michelin road maps were reproduced in England for the Allied invasion during World War II. The Germans also reproduced in 1940-1938 edition Michelin maps for the invasion. Via Michelin is a wholly owned subsidiary of Michelin Group and was started in 2001 to represent Michelin's digital mapping services. As of August 2008, Via Michelin generates 400 million maps and routes per month on its main website. Via Michelin provides mapping and travel solutions for Internet, mobile and satellite navigation products with street-level coverage of Europe, USA, Australia, and parts of Asia and South America. The Michelin Challenge to Vendum is a major sustainable mobility event. In 1952, six years after Michelin patented its radial casing, Michelin adapted the radial technology to truck tires. From 1999, the company was headed by CEO Edward Michelin. On 26 May 2006, Edward drowned while fishing near the island of Seine off the coast of Brittany. His death brought Michel Rollier, a second cousin of Edward Michelin, to the head of the company. Rollier was replaced in May 2012 by Jean-Dominique Senner. In 2018, Jean-Dominique Sinner announced he would not seek re-election at the shareholders' meeting in 2019. As a result, the shareholders elected Florent Menigo to succeed Sinner, starting in 2019. The company also has its headquarters in Greenville, South Carolina, United States as Michelin North America. They first manufactured in the city in 1975 before opening up their headquarters a decade later. Executive committees are Terry Geddes, R&D, Jean-Michel Gillen, Personnel and Safety, Mark Henry, CFO, Serge Lesson, Trucks, and Laurent Newell, Corporate Development.